Unit 3, Lesson 3 Rice People all over the world eat rice. Millions of people in Asia, Africa, and South America eat it every day of their lives. Some people eat almost nothing but rice. Rice is a kind of grass. There are more than 7,000 kinds of rice. Farmers grow rice in many countries, even in the southern part of the United States and in eastern Australia. No one really knows where rice came from. Some scientists think that it started to grow in two places. They think that one kind of rice grew in southern Asia thousands of years ago. Someone in China wrote about it almost 5,000 years ago. Another kind probably grew in West Africa. Other scientists think that rice came from India, and Indian travelers took it to other parts of the world. There are two main ways to grow rice. Upland rice grows in dry soil. Most rice grows in wet soil. People in many countries do all of the work of growing rice by hand. This is the same way farmers worked hundreds of years ago. In some countries, people now use machines on their rice farms. The farmers all use fertilizer. Some insects are enemies of rice. Farmers poison them. People use every part of the rice plant. They make animal feed and rice oil from it. They also make baskets, brooms, rugs, sandals, and roofs for their houses. They burn dry rice plants in fires for cooking. Unit 3, Lesson 4, Oranges Everybody loves oranges. They are sweet and juicy. They are in sections, so it is easy to eat them. Some oranges do not have any seeds. Some have a thick skin, and some have a thin skin. The orange tree is beautiful. It has a lot of shiny green leaves. The small white flowers smell very sweet. An orange tree has flowers and fruit at the same time. There were orange trees 20 million years ago. The oranges were very small, not like the ones today. The orange tree probably came from China. Many different kinds of wild oranges grow there today. The Chinese started to raise orange trees around 4,400 years ago. Chinese art has lovely old pictures of oranges and orange trees. Farmers in other parts of Asia and the Middle East learned to raise oranges from the Chinese. Then they taught Europeans. The Spanish planted orange trees in the New World, North and South America. They took them to Florida first. Oranges are a very important crop in Florida today. In English, orange means both a fruit and a color. We use the name of the fruit for the color.